Hello friends, welcome to another WooCommerce video tutorial. One of my clients wants me to stop people editing billing email address from the checkout page of WooCommerce or his store. So actually he is not uh, uh, allowing people to register and create their account. So the owner creates account for them and uh, uh, user have to use that particular email address. So he could match it with uh, other details that he is maintaining uh, in a local or in other software. So he want to restrict email address from the checkout field, billing email address, and also user should not be able to edit the email field uh, from the account management facility, user's account management facility. Uh, so. I thought let me create one video for you guys so you can see how we can restrict users from editing any uh, checkout fields or other fields they could see the details but they could not edit them so let's get started here uh, I'm going to add one product you can see and here it is let's go to checkout page in the checkout phase here is my email address and you can see i can edit other details but not email address it is a read only field right now and uh, if i go to my account and addresses and then edit a billing details and i go here to change my email address you can see i can add data in phone number but not added email address so let us see how I did this okay uh, I'm using actually a storefront theme you could have your own and e-commerce so let us see how I did this for that you have to add code in your child themes functions.php file I'm not using child theme right now, so I'm adding a code into a uh, parent theme functions.php file. So you can uh, do it from the back end, or if you have it, you can do it from there also. Here in appearance editor, you can see here storefront theme. Here is my functions.php file. At the very bottom, I have added this code you can read here disable email editing of billing address from checkout page and disable email editing of billing address from edit address page okay for better view i'm uh, shifting to the color code you can see here my function.php file okay so what i did here is add action WooCommerce checkout field. So we have to add an action for, to uh, get all the uh, WooCommerce checkout field and apply our changes. This is the function name that we are going to write here. Read only billing email. It has parameter checkout field and in the checkout field billing billing email. We are going to add our custom attribute. WooCommerce allow to add our custom attributes so here we can add our custom attribute and you can see I have added the attribute read only so read only read only this will make that particular field in email a read only field so user can see it but cannot modify it in the same way I'm going to edit uh, uh, stop people editing email address from the edit address functionality page you can see for that i have added a filter here remember you have to add action here and here it is a filter in the filter woocommerce billing field stop edit billing email this is my function stop edit billing email in the same way above i'm going to as we are this array is going to return all the shipping fields, all the uh, billing fields, 
everything so we have to uh, check out this multi-dimensional array like this a billing and billing email but we are going to edit here only billing fields all the billing side fields you can see here we have okay in the action it will it is going to return all these billing fields and all these shipping fields and all these other extra uh, fields created so we have to specify it like this a billing and in the billing we are we need to modify the data of billing email and uh, for to stop uh, here in my account addresses to stop user editing email here we have to specify this filter we are this these fields are going to return only email, billing field addresses this one okay so we do not need to here specify billing in the array there is a directly billing email and then custom attributes here again the custom attributes is read only so this field will become a read only so that was the code uh, now maybe some people ask me what what if i want to change other fields or uh, make them read only so uh, how can i find the attributes here so it is very simple you need to add here you need to write echo and uh, three you're actually seeing all the fields of the array we have available here to modify okay so French ah. this is this checkout fields contain all the array of checkout page fields okay now we need to let, let's go to the checkout page uh, on our website and we will see all the fields there so here I am on checkout page and let me reload you can see all the fields available here billing this is the uh, multi-dimensional array so here billing billing has a billing first name billing last name you can see billing company and billing country in the same way billing address one two city state postcode phone and here is our billing email that we have added our read only custom attribute here you can see here a custom attribute read only that we have added here by this function okay so you can choose any field here to make read only you just need to specify it like this like if, if, if i want to i'm going to copy and paste and like if I want to make this phone number read only then I'm going to use this billing phone it is billing billing phone and you can see your custom attribute now let's reload you can see here yes you can see the phone is now read only I could not write anything here so that is simple so uh, this is just an example how you can stop people from editing checkout and address fill of the WooCommerce. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.